This driver desperately tries not to panic when he notices the rosas behind him. But as soon as the road ahead is clear, he does what any cool-headed criminal would do in a situation like this. He floors it. The officer gives chase, and it's not long before the fugitive has notched up a catalogue of crimes, including speeding and reckless driving. The fugitive crashes into another vehicle, just up here. Chase should be over at this point. But the driver is about to prove just how unhinged he really is. A second police vehicle arrives on the scene. Good news for the first officer, because he's going to need all the help he can get. Both troopers approach the suspect's car, weapons in hand. And the suspect does a kind of Dukes of Hazard style exit. The cops notice the man is armed with something, so this officer gives him a quick pop with his taser. But this nutcase displays Terminator-style resistance and rips out the darts as if it was fired from a kid's toy. As the scene continues, the road is closed and more officers arrive to join the capture. But even with at least half a dozen cops all trying to zap him with their tasers, this guy just ain't going down. As he approaches the dash cam of the original cruiser, we can see that his weapon is in fact just a screwdriver. But the cops ain't going to get pushed around by some psychotic Bob the Builder, so just off camera, they shoot him again. And this time, not with a taser. Though his wounds aren't fatal, his screwdriver-wielding days are certainly over. But he's not the only one who's taken a hit. The trigger-happy officer manages an impressive double whammy of shooting the suspect and his female colleague. In slow motion, you can see the cop's bullet kick up dust here as it ricochets off the road and into the leg of the officer here. This bloke was a danger to everyone on the road. But when it came to the crunch, he wasn't as dangerous as this cop here, who managed to hospitalise the suspect and someone who was supposed to be his friend. the feeling someone just isn't cut out for police work? That maybe they should be selling discount curtains instead? Sir, I ask you a question. What do you have illegal on you? You are in the car. Knives, weapons, narcotics. Because we're not having a... Let's face it, this cop hasn't exactly got the bedside manner to do nursing. She's trying to physically threaten this male suspect, but she's only a little bigger than a garden gnome. Don't you move. I'm going to shut you with this, with this right now. Do you understand me? She can't even remember the name of her taser. Maybe she should try asking him nicely. I'm going to shoot you with this taser. Get out of the car, you're under arrest. You are under arrest for driving under suspension. Get out of the car, do it now. I'm not driving under suspension. As things start to slip out of hand, a battle royal commences. Get out of the car, now! This officer, a few streets away, receives a request for tag team style backup. You guys take care, I gotta go somewhere else, okay? Drive careful. He hops in his car, hits the lights, and speeds off to help her out. But by this time, she's having real trouble. In the scuffle, the suspect grabs her taser from her and zaps her. Since the bad guy has a taser, maybe this new car has bought some spare kit. She might want to lend the con something else, maybe a gun. Release her! Release her! Release her! Go now! Get on the fucking ground! Get on the ground! Put him on the ground! Put him on the ground! I don't have a taser! Few things are more embarrassing for a cop than pulling a taser, having it taken from you and getting zapped yourself. Oh, and receiving a good slap round the ear while four officers bail you out of trouble. Get down! Down right now! No, not not me. Me. Yes, cops are trained to deal with every situation in the smartest way possible. In this case, she might have wanted to try a little charm instead of threatening some kind of midget smackdown. Get out of the car. Sir, you're under arrest because... Don't! Don't you move! I'm going to shut you with this... 
with this right now. And after his fire with the taser, he could have got himself shot. Ah, oh, what could have been? If he just hit her a little bit harder, she could have pulled a gun out and done him. And who said US cops are trigger happy? <laughs>